And welcome back guys, we're going to be playing some more Cyberpunk 2077 Phantom Liberty DLC Remastered Cyberpunk 2077. Make sure to the like button, make sure to subscribe button, let's get back into it. Gotta hand it to Hanson V. Party's hopping. Has a sense of grandeur. Didn't have shit like this in my day. Now hop on over there and help me out. Manage to forget what real champagne tastes like. I'll be at the bar if you need me. Welcome. Would you care for some champagne? CPD commissioners, politicians, diplomats, celebrities, corp execs? Don't mind if I do. A pleasant evening to you. I know that it was specially done for us. What now? I know as much as you do. All she said was to come here. She'll either find us or she left us something. And you? What's your play? I think I'm starting to feel the vibe. Just remember what we're here for. To my right, Booth's far back behind the stairs. The guy in the fatigues. Looks like he came here straight from a firing range. Owner of the Black Sapphire, Mr. D-Town himself, Kurt Hansen. Clearly having a great night in the company of the NCPD commissioner. PA broadcast. He fiercely anti-law enforcement. It's an act. Behind closed doors, he's rubbing elbows and patting backs of NCPD's top brass. Avoid him, especially in a confrontation. Beside that, stay visible. Songbird said she'd find us here. Let's give her a chance. I'll grab a drink and look around. Open line on comms. Don't press anyone too hard. We need to keep up appearances. Look like you're having fun. Gin and tonic, please. Say, I'm looking for a friend. We're supposed to meet here. Okay. Does your friend have a name? Song saw me. Korean lady. Around 30. Hmm. Might have seen her around. On this floor, I think. Was she alone? Was she? No. No, she was with Colonel Hansen, I think. But... He's in sight with other people now, and she ain't one of them. Yeah, I can see that. Is that Have one on me later, yeah? Here's the deal. Either we get some things... ...as as you wish, sir. Non-violent, Roger. Meaning what? Exactly. Meaning you will sue us. Take us to court. Put on a show for the people. I'm prepared to testify that this, uh, undertaking... Hmm? ...was commissioned... We will discuss this at the later time. It's not about your upbringing. Look, I'm a self-made man. Borrowed a hundred grand from my parents and invested it in myself. Didn't go spending it all on Cinco, get expensive ass. But on implants and training. Gave it all back to second and court. Exactly. It's about self -discipline. Of course. I'm always open to compromise. You really have no one to blame but yourself. She wants just do it. I just fucking lost it. Talking to myself, boys, for serious songs. And 
some ripper quest is going to explain fashion trends to my daughter. In the end, they shut their traps and gave me a discount. But I had to disown her. I mean, if she wants to inherit my money, she'll have to look like human royalty. Any other mods? but I'm sure it's so good you're here don't know what I'd do without you V really that didn't exactly give me a choice now did you told me to show up here and just ghost it the uh, runner your friend who, who helped us reconnect last time killed him fried him didn't I You didn't kill Slider. Blackwell did. Lucky as hell it didn't flatline you, too. I ran out of time... to explain... everything. Saul... I've made... so many mistakes. It's all right, Saul. Not your fault. The blame's on us. All of it. On you? I is all of them. I know what they made you do. They pushed and pushed, and I... I wasn't there to stop it. Listen, guys. We do not have the time for this now. Right. Main thing is to get you out of here. That's... not happening. It is. We got in, we can get out. Just Not the me. point. I'm dying, Saul. Like V. Hansen has the cure we need. We run now, we both die. Relic's killing V. Blackwall's my poison. I can't bow out now. You got a plan. Hear in your voice. Yeah. One I can't hope to enact without your help. Hansen pulled some tech out of a bunker under Dogtown. Tech that could cure both V and me. We need to clep it. Only way I see of doing that is to stay close. Play the prisoner. So, fuck. We'll wait for an opportunity and pounce. I'll be on the inside, ask for your help when the time's right. I can flee once I have that tech. Nothing's ever simple, is it? Huh. So me. Care to introduce your friends? It's not often I'm simply not familiar with guests attending my own party. And I never forget a face. Kurt Hansen. Name's V. Just V. Haven't seen so me in years. Trying to catch up. Oh, that's what this is. To me, reunions consist of... Picking up the broken, scattered shards of your heart. Or teeth. Always hurts. Well, I need to grab you, darling. I have a couple NC politicos here who are dying to meet you. And if we're to keep hungry rats from devouring Dogtown, we really do need to feed them the occasional scraps. I'm all yours, Kurt. See you soon, V. Established our link the moment I touched you. Interesting. I need a minute to process. And I need a drink. Heading downstairs. 
I'll explain everything. Just need you to listen. What's the deal, Song? Doubt I've ever seen a prisoner parade around in a cocktail dress at a swanky party. Not to mention being hella friendly with their captor. It's a charade, V. Doing what I need to survive, to get what I want. I'm letting Hansen show me off like his personal trophy. V, I... I can't explain everything now. It's... too much. But I really do need your help. All I want is to get that cure for us. It's what I've been chasing all along. The cure. How do we get it? We need the neural matrix. Secret tech that incorporates AIs from beyond the black wall. The matrix is nested in a mainframe Hansen pulled out of the bunker. The mainframe secured, but Hansen lacks the key. That's the problem. Got a plan? Spill it. Hansen needs me and a duo of runners who worked on this tech in the past. They actually grabbed access codes they're willing to unload for a price. Classic black market shit. They're bringing access, I'm bringing know-how about how to pull the matrix and data off the mainframe. We're to work side by side, giving us a chance. You clip the access codes, then get the runners out of the way. You'll then impersonate them for a meet with Hansen. Same meet where we'll swipe the matrix out from under his nose. I think I got it. Our targets, where will we find them? They're here, downstairs. Red-headed twins, walled to the teeth with ice. Grocery scans will show you bunk. Prem, noted. Anything else? Champagne glass over there. Prep some intel for you. Get it to read. You'll need it later. Really need to go now, B. I'm counting on you. Songbird? Great. Okay.
Seems you're... Talk to Songbird via the relic. We can communicate again. Hmm. All good there, Reed? Yeah. I just need to process for a minute. It's just how I'm built. A little adversity and I need a few moments to think. Come up with anything? Yeah. We now know who took a swipe at Myers' head. Handsome. Yeah, but not really. Don't know about you, but I see coincidences as patterns. Structures we have yet to recognize. Huh. What you driving at? SF-1 crashes. Not anywhere, but over specific turf. Controlled by someone who found some obscure forgotten tech in a secret bunker. Right. Crash was an inside job. We suspected that from the get-go. Now we know it was. And we know it was Songbird. She was behind it. And it took you just one drink to cobble that together? Started seeing the pieces falling into place up on the mezzanine. So Omi told her she's dying. Things follow from that. She made a deal with Hanson earlier. Had to. Before any of this went down. Traded the president's life for access to the tech. If there's truth to this, Song's guilty of... high treason. Her and her actions, I won't judge. Not my place. As I see it, Somi was playing both sides, simultaneously spinning deals with Hansen and you. She has Hansen set, then you come in. She contacts you via the relic, asks you to rescue the president. Absolution for her right there. You need to cure just as much, guaranteeing you'll help if her plan falls through. And here we are. Yeah, and here we are, rushing to Songbird's rescue. Thinking a few steps ahead was always her strength. But judgment calls and situational assessment, her Achilles heel. As a chess master, she'd be famous for dazzling plays and excruciatingly beautiful defeats. Still trust her. Trust she'll keep her word. Promise me the cure, and I fully intend to get it. Only thing that matters, really. I'd be careful. Mind sharp. Eyes and ears attuned. But I know Somi well enough to know she'll do her damnedest to be fair. Right. Just branded your beloved Bella the Ball, who you're out to rescue, a traitor. Well, now, what do you want to do about it? You know, V, treason ain't ever black and white. They try to zero me once, too. What if we've all been played? Main thing now is to get her out of this cesspool of a sitch. Then we'll see which direction to take. Right. Still should watch her every move closely. Sure. Unconditional trust? No more. Out the window. Right. Back to the sitch at hand. What do we have to do to save her? To grab the tech Songbird and I both need, we gotta go to a meet with Hansen. Prep for it's required. Because we show up as a pair of runners. Need to collect their identities first. Whatever that means. Personality imprint theft. Sounds like our Colombian job of yore. Who are they and where do we find them? Song got this shard to me. Take a look. Our targets are a brother and sister, red-haired twins. They're here somewhere, schmoozing. Hmm. Okay, we need to pull data. Get samples of assorted behavior. We make contact with them, talk, scan as we talk. Got it, I think. So, time to make our move? Over there. Twin roulette, looks like. Alex, you copy that? Radio loud and clear, prep and scan tech now. You're new to this, but relax. We'll do it as a four-hander. I scan one, you handle the other. Alex will pilot us through. B, zipping funds your way from our operating budget. Load up on chips and join their game. Just don't go all in from the get-go. We stagger our approach, and we're strangers. Let's get to this.
Struck gold with roulette, really. Gambling throws people around, high and low, brings the joy of winning and the despair of defeat. Perfect for our purposes. Greetings, madam. Wanna buy some chips? Of course. Good luck at the tables. V, important. You're not there to have fun. Simple bets, red or black only. None of the double street or basket bullshit. Please Understood? Please. Understood. Will you join us? Betting's open? By all means. Make it red. Relax. Buy him drinks, break the ice. I'll join you momentarily. All bets are in. Bidding is closed. What? No introduction? V. You? Aurore Cassel. And that boar is my brother, Emeric. What's your poison? My treat. A bourbon for me. Alas, mon frère does not drink. You heard the lady. And real water for the gentleman here. And what'll you have? Same as the lady. Bourbon coming up. Your drinks will be here shortly. 27. Odd. Eh merde! Place your bets, please. <gasps> Last chance. Let's go, let's Good. go. Good. B. Can't get a hold of Reed. No idea where he is. Stall for time, okay? Hmm, I just realized. Uh, you must have dirt beneath your fingernails, too. Like all these bastards and bitches. That is, unless you're uh, in tourist. Like the no-lifers who must watch others live to feel anything. Provocative, this one. You got me. No-lifer, tourist, whatever your preference. <laughs> you're just teasing. Booty. Even. Red. Ah, oh, yes. Ah! Fucking done here! Duh. <sighs> Place your bets, please. Can't help feeling I uh, interrupted something when I walked up. Do not worry yourself about this. Oh, come, come. V is just being cordial. Miss Pavi, you weren't snooping just now, Three. were you? Odd. Red. Still no sign from Reed, V. Got a sinking feeling about this. Place your bets, please. Eight's my magic number, so gonna go with eight. Ah, oh, you got me. <laughs> On to you big time. But in my defense, you guys stand out. Even in a crowd like this one. Oh, really? Listening to conversations of strangers can be... dangerous. Sometimes you can hear more than you can handle. Listen, Reed's MIA for now, can't wait for him. Gotta do both scans on your own. Uh, we were discussing local politics, uh, specifically our host, Monsieur Kurt Hansen. Big fish selling big guns for big money. Yet here you have uh, celebrities, politicians, even the chief of police. So I was thinking, uh, perhaps Hansen would do better by being a veritable businessman, no? I claim he would. Mon cher frère disagrees. 21. Odd. Red. Ugh. Guess it's not my lucky day. Place your bets, please. Who 
is Kurt Hansen really? A crucial question. Tread carefully with that duo, V. Certainly not liable to become a taxpaying, law-abiding night citizen. Kickbacks to NC officials. Are they not taxes, not protection money? Doing business carries a price. Dogtown needs Night City to prosper. Hansen needs it. Une diversification of profit centers makes sense. I myself have a small firm in Paris. My stand-in takes calls, arranges meetings, and deflects, deflects, deflects. Why would he need that? Hansen! Uh, providing weapons to Banana Republics is not quite a sure and stable business. Six. Even. Black. Place your bets, please. Tu ne serais pas en train de devenir trop pote avec elle. Oh, fais pas ton jaloux, petit frère. C'est pas comme si on allait baiser, elle et moi. Pretty shameless bastard, aren't you? Oh, I agree. I mean, Hansen could take Dog down by the throat, eject the junkies, and make it a paradise for billionaires. Just getting rich is dull. You should work for the community. Invest, create jobs, throw banquettes. She's getting chatty. Doing good, V. And charities are excellent washing machines. You launder billions, believe me. Eleven. Odd. Black. Place your bets, please. And you're so childish. It's beautiful. What? Hansen going missionary position in business? Nonsense. <sighs> Reed's still not responding. But you keep working it. Let's go. Swap twins. And basically owns Dogtown. Could use that as leverage. And who would Hansen be? The mayor? Please. He is very good at what he does. A professional criminal. Soldier yesterday, crime lord today. Why not biz shark tomorrow? Yet he is a businessman. And to make it legal, it is a lot of work to do for a simple change of label. Good. Little worms opening up. 22. Even. Et ben voilà, c'est comme ça qu'on fait. Place your bets, please. Care to expand? Floor's yours. Allow me to say, V. Arms or property, it would make no difference to me what I sell. And to spend five years on efforts to uh, change how people see you, call you. To be upstanding in the eyes of others. I could not give a shit. 18. Even. Red. Ah, damn. I should have bet on red. Place your bets, please. Getting there. Almost got it. Give me something big now. Make him laugh or cry, I don't care. Please place your bets. How about we go all in? Bet everything we won tonight. <gasps> and we play different colors, yes? You win or we do. And either you or we lose all. My thoughts exactly. A moment. You join the table, buy drinks, talk and talk. Now you wish to risk everything? I find this disquieting. Perhaps you could now tell us about yourself. Name's V, afterlife affiliated. Make what you will of it. Oh, are you happy now? You choose first, then. I'm seeing red coming. Black for us, then.
Leave us for a moment, if you please. Congratulations to you. I know your friend Reed is FIA. My natural assumption is, you're an agent too. I'm also guessing you two took it upon yourselves to save the president, then exfil her out of Dogtown. I should send you back to Night City in body bags, filled with pieces. You trying to scare me? Dunno. Are you afraid? We're just talking, aren't we? Wow, you cracked it. Clever man. To be honest, I got tired of the media circus. All the allegations thrown in my face. The bullshit propaganda. Luckily, we can put all that behind us now. Always willing to help. Don't you worry. Got your back, Colonel. I will let you and Reed walk free of this place. In one piece. On your own two feet. Consider it a gesture of my goodwill. Your little bird came to me on her own, though. She was tired of breaking international laws on the president's whim. She simply had to run away. Breaching the black wall, jeopardizing the net, all humankind's safety, in fact, for personal gain. I wonder what Netwatch would say. Pass it on to President Myers. Also tell her, her toy of mass destruction is my friend now. And she should get the fuck out of my backyard, or the world will learn about her games. I've matters to attend to. You'll find Mr. Reed downstairs. Okay, V. Got all we need. Okay, what do I do now? Haul ass out of there. Bitch, that I'd find Reed downstairs. Yeah, heard him. Wasn't crazy about his tone. Time to evac me. Best not tempt the fates. Head to the elevator, ride down to one. Need to know what's up with Saul. going to eat something, Lizzie. No buts. Hey there, Lizzie. V, what are you doing here? Could legitimately ask you the same. <laughs> yeah, I might be a little out of place, but I get around. And Dogtown, well, it always gets my blood course. Fortunately, I have darling Avi here. Avi's my new bodyguard. The best I've ever had, if a little too overprotective. Pleasure, Avi. Headset's Nova, Lizzie. <laughs> like it? Here, it's yours then. For real? Sure, got loads of them. You'll look like you're on Team Wiz Wiz. It's liable to take you places. I want you to have it. Oh, thanks, Lizzie. Looking like you're about to delta out of here. Making my exit soon, yeah. But from one party on to another, a chum of mine from Legos is throwing one on his yacht. Friends, fireworks, diving, a private fashion show. Hmm, shame. Some R&R out on the water would do you good. But I'm sure you're, like, super busy. Plus, knowing him, there's gonna be drama, so I'm totally sparing you. Totally. Thanks.
What a headdress. Are you yeah, I see your invitation, man. Um, sure. Is everything in order? No need to worry. Routine verification. Please enjoy your evening. Is something happening? Hmm. People are checking. Thinking about what that prick said. Guy knows. Got some dirt on Myers. Can't imagine it happening. But if the public learns that any U.S. president willingly broke international laws governing cyberspace use... Then USA is fucked. Myers will either have to take the fall, let herself be buried in dirt for this, or she'll defy the world and spark another war. Fuck me! Songbirds are walking to prime her for use whenever he wants. Listen, V, we need to get her out. For everyone's sake. Oh, just once I'd like to see things go smoothly, as planned. This feels so very, very wrong. You and your troom best be headed the fuck out now. Straight? I'm going. I'm going. Sheesh. Fucking gonk? Smart choice. Leaving already? How was the party? You have a good time? No. Yeah, that's right. We'll be out in moments. Now fuck off. Good call. Stop it, let's go. Fuck off. Follow me. Follow me on. How things go, V? Got everything. All set. You got thorough scans of the runners. Both of them. Yourself. I said, we got everything. Well, well. And then you, uh, excused yourself. Stepped away. Disappeared. Hansen showed up. We chatted. Threats were made, actually. Said if Myers doesn't let up, world will learn about Songbird. About Pierce and the Blackwall. He clearly knows what Somi means to the president. Personal WMD, you mean? Yeah, Hansen knows all. Need to get her the fuck out, Reed. Really? I was afraid of this. Okay. P, Alex and I have work. We need to analyze the data from Songbird. Might take a day or two. Prem, open comms line then? Sure. We'll work out a game plan. Get back to you ASAP. Oh, and V, bang up work. Alrighty, that looks like a good place to stop. Make sure to like button, make sure to subscribe button, and I'll see you guys next video.